welcome to the second part guys now over here create the listening event of this button dot set and click listener new there you go now call this class we have just created over here like this oh sorry i forgot to write one code over here open and for is equal to this dot get writable we have to write the content we enter in the registration form into our sqlite database so db is equal to open helper dot get writable database and over here define the variable that is your first name is equal to txt f name dot get text dot to string and similar for other simply copy this this is for last name this is for password this is for email and this is for phone number and change the variable name txt as ergo txt email ergo txt font now after this on create method create another method public void insert data and the parameter goes to string f name to string l name to string hash to string email to string phone Now inside this method, we have to write our code like this. Contain values. Contain values is equal to new content values. This class is used to write the value in the database now content values dot put call our method database helper dot which column column two because column one is id which is auto incremented and will auto inserted by the database. There goes first name. Simply copy this and this 
two over here. Algorithm column three, algorithm column four, algorithm column five, and then algorithm column six. And change the variable. Last name. Algorithm as algorithm email and algorithm phone. And at the end, long ID is equal to db dot insert. We have to insert in our database. Database helper dot table name null and here goes the content value there you go now you need to simply call this function over here insert data first name last name as mail phone now after inserting we need to display some message to the user so source dot mac test get application context register successfully source dot length long dot so now after writing this code and you need to run this application in your adb now before running this application in adb i want to tell something you need to create your adb having the android version below lollipop with api level 22 if you configure your adb with marshmallow, marshmallow or higher you cannot access the file explorer from android device monitor and we cannot see the database so this will be the box from api level 24 so you need to create a adb having the api level 22 select the your adb and then click ok and then click proceed with our instant one now it will take some time and in order to see your database sqlite database you have to download one software having name db browser for sqlite which is a high quality visual open source tool to create a design and edit database file compatible with sqlite the link is in the description section below now our project is running it will take some time
our replication is run and let's try it does something over here it does something and click register and the message will appear or speak from program right let me see We got some problem. Okay, we will check our problem in the third part, guys.